Hey Julian, Thompson here again from Budget Income Cars in Manica. Thank you very much for your email inquiry in regards to our Mazda CX-5. We have been, I've got a couple of them here on the yard. As you can see, uh, they're both the 2.5 litre model from memory. Um, this is the one you obviously you're asking about. You've done just under 26,000 Ks, 2013 model with the safety pack pre-crash, and it's down from 28,900 to 23,900. Just so you know, we don't do that. Um, you know, some companies make the price up, go, oh, it was this and now it's this, and it never was that previous price. It definitely was that price. Um, we're looking at, um, we've actually been cranking through the deals. Our Japanese bosses are pretty happy with the stock, and they want us to just try and move the rest on, because we've got much more coming over, because um, the numbers are finally picking up after, you know, the corona stuff, and the Ukraine Russia, which is pretty obviously stinking. Bad for business, I know, it's, there's a lot of personal going on, but it's picking up funny for us. Um, so the Japanese bosses discounts a lot of these cars to move them on. Um, so 25 and a half thousand Ks there. You've got the perforated leather trim interior. Uh, looks like this has the six airbags. You've got two on the seats, uh, one each on the front. I believe you've got um, one side good one on each side there as well. You've got dual climate control there. Um, now, before I forget, oh, and, and both speakers, um, I do want to note down the bad stuff of the car before you do come on in. So you've got a mark there on the wing mirror. That should be able to get polished off. It doesn't look like it's gone into the paintwork. Um, again, on that door handle. But the big thing I noticed was up on the headlight here. You see this uh, discoloration there? So we might be able to sort that out. Um, there's a company called Renew that can come out and usually do a recoat on that. So hopefully the boss will be happy with doing that. Um, it doesn't look... They look great to be honest. You got is the 18 and 19 inch rims in the four corners. Let me just double check this. 19 inch original Mazda wheels. Looks like they've got pretty decent tread, maybe um, 80% at least, I reckon, in all four corners. Um, ice fix in the back there. These seats do fold down flat as well. And um, in most of these six ways, there are levers in the back here that you can pull uh, to drop those seats down. So you can see over here, you got this lever, you got these ones here as well. Zip with this bit. Then get past tray which uh, retracts back with the, um, the boot uh, tailgate as well. Reversing camera. It is uh, sky active, which means it's slightly cheaper gas, slightly more powerful than the previous ones. Our uh, main thing is though they've got better structural rigidity, handling, and safety. This one does have the cruise control, automatic headlights. You've got your RVM, so rear vehicle monitoring. Um, you've got AFS for headlights. It'll turn the headlights around the corner as you turn. I stopped saving a bit of gas. You can turn all these things off if you'd like, and your uh, trash control there as well. You've got power driver seat. Um, what else is there? Um, it will have, it's a Japanese head unit because it's from Japan, but it will have a Bluetooth in there. Shouldn't be too hard to link up. Um, Bluetooth doesn't care about what language you use. Um, that, and it'll be good for phone calls. And I think you might even play music with your phone as well. Um, and the front right headlight also a little bit faded around there as well. I'll try to put this video through ASAP before we do come on in. Okay, Julian. See you, mate.